You sound like you're gonna die, Sloopy. You sound like you're gonna die, Sloopy. I've been. Don't do that. Cleaning and such. Don't do that. Moving stuff around. Dust. Punching. Started late. Just turned on audio. Mm -hmm. Let's do the intro. Do that beautiful. Welcome to another great episode of the Coco Nation Game On Challenge. Where this week we are playing Pontan again. Some of us will also be playing Mind Roll. Have nothing to say about that. It's a mind roll. If you're playing on a, uh, if you're playing on, a, uh, on um, if you're playing mind roll on an emulator, make sure you turn down the um, CPU speed, because <laughs> it flies. It's a hand. It flies. It's a hand. Oh, you're gonna try and do a speed run. No, I'm turning it down. I'm turning it down. There. Okay, I don't understand this game. Okay, I don't understand this game. What's not to understand? Okay, so I got 38 points on plane one. Now it's so I get to choose another one. So we're gonna do them in order. Ah, no, you can. There's no um, you can play them in any order you want, or start at any level you want. Or oh, okay, I didn't know that. Yeah, there's a bonus level. I did not know that. Yeah, there's a bonus level. I did not know that. Apparently, there's a bonus level. Apparently, there's a bonus level. Look at that. Hey, that's what I said. Yeah, I saw it, but I failed it completely. Yeah, I saw it, but I failed. Yeah, so did I, because I had no idea what I was doing. Yeah, so did I, because I had no idea what I was doing. Hey, I got 38 points. Hey, I got 38 points. Hey, I got 1,300 points. You must not be playing Mind Roll.
Ah. I had 90 points there. I had 90 points there. Nice. Oh. Each one is a separate little puzzle. Yeah, each level is uh, something different. Oh, go for it. Don't, it'll crash. <laughs> Don't, it'll crash. That theater might. Your computer. Mm -hmm. I mean, basically everything always makes it crash, doesn't it? Basically everything always makes it crash, doesn't it? Not everything. <laughs> the off button works. <laughs> That makes it crash in a way. No, I mean, it, it functions, turns off. <laughs> makes it very secure. No, it's not get into my. Can't get in. Parasite. Was mind roll similar to Marvel Madness? Pushy? Mm. No. It's more of a problem solving game. It's all the different little objectives. Is that my clue to read the directions? Yes. It might be helpful. Dang it. I ended up closing with Chrome again. Don't do that. Did you do the intro? I don't even remember. Did you do the did. intro? I don't even remember. No. Oh. I just didn't say hello to everyone. Oh, I was going to say, I don't. <sighs> yeah. But... Well, how about right now we say hello to everybody? Hi. We did. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. I think I'm losing it tonight. What? Losing it. Yeah, you, you fell asleep. You did the intro. <laughs> okay. mm -hmm. you, you can't lose what you never had, Mark. Well, I'm assuming you're talking about your sanity. I'm assuming you're talking about your sanity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, at least you're doing better than my daughter. One day, uh, they took her home. She was like, I gotta go to uh, Walmart tomorrow. We go later today. 
what time does it open? And because of power, they open at six. Get off work at six. He's like, well, we could go now if you want. And I'm like, yeah, because I don't want to drive uh, six miles out of here to your house and go another all the way up to Walmart and then six miles home. An extra 12 miles. Could have figured this out when we're still at the uh, at your work. We'll have to go on to the closer Walmart. Yeah, well, I took her to Walmart. But she needs to get spray painted. One of her co workers uh, used to do uh, make. Um, needs to get tagged? Props. Uh, cosplay. Uh huh. He get. He got so many orders he couldn't keep up production, so he's considering doing it again. My daughter will be be the one that does like painting of his stuff. She did get spray paint because she has this big huge cord. <laughs> um, we go to Walmart. She gets the spray paint. She also gets a wall charger for. So last night when I go to pick her up for work, I said, so did you get anything done in your days off? She goes, not really. And I said, get the sword done? She goes, no. Get it started. And she goes, Why not? She goes, well, I put down the bag. I got in the house and started to uh, did something. And then when I went to get the bag, I couldn't find it. I don't remember what I did with it. I go and find it. She goes, yeah. I looked all over for it. My roommate looked all over for it. I don't know what I did with it. And I says, you're way too young to be going senile in your room. She goes, why is that? And I says, well, I needed to look in the floor of the car. She goes, the floor of the car. She looked down at the floor. She goes, not there. And I says, no, but that's where you left it. In the back seat now. <laughs> Yeah. I said, you don't have to go see now. That's my job. I'm the parent. <sighs> okay. Here we go. Mind roll. And it has the dash. Catalog number 26-3100. A 3D game of speed and dexterity from Epic. Oh, Uptown now, huh? What is Epic? Oh, E P Y X. It'd be Epic. Okay. Is the game Epic though? Is. I don't know. I couldn't get past level one. Uh, let's see. It says, relax. Take a deep breath and leave your body behind. Uh, I might need it. Um, you're now in the orb of id. Ready to bump, bash, and roll and crash through ten different planes of an insane 3D puzzle. Isn't uh, yes, it is. who did Wolfenstein and Doom? What was the name of them? Yeah, I don't know if it's the same company or not. Slide around, shocking electric seas, bounce off invisible walls, and pick up keys and amulets to escape the disturbingly infinite mazes. Move fast to finish each plane in time, but don't get careless. One step over the edge and you'll fall into the deep, dark void of feud. Yeah, I did that a few times. 
I thought dropping down the void was how you get to the next level. It is in some of them. <laughs> oh, the hardware. system components. You'll need the following equipment to play Mind Roll. A tandy color computer 2 or 3 with 64K of memory. Well, the color computer 3 did not come with 64K of memory. I think they mean at least. Oh, well, then they should be specific. Uh, RGB monitor or color television. Okay. Joystick is optional. Next page. Getting started. Make sure your Tandy color computer is turned off before inserting or removing a program pack. In this case, it's not going to matter. Game isn't going to work anyway. Set up your system if you're using a joystick connected to the left joystick port on the back of the computer. Insert the Mind Roll program pack label side up into the cartridge slot on the right side of the computer. Turn on your monitor or television, and then turn your computer. The first screen appears. Now, they have assumed that you have set both to the correct channel in this case. Um, for the color computer 3, choose the monitor type by pressing R for RGB or C for the color television or color comp composite monitor. <sighs> okay, number 5. For the color computer 2 or 3, press J for joystick or K for keyboard control. Number 6. Mind Roll title screen appears. After the title music plays, a demonstration game begins. Press the space bar or the fire button at any time to begin play. Number seven. The choose plane table appears. Highlight the plane you want by moving the joystick handle, pressing the left or right arrow keys, or typing the correct number. Press the fire button or spacebar to begin playing that plane. When you solve a plane, the bonus plane appears. Follow the arrows to play around the bonus round. When the bonus round ends, press spacebar or the fire button. The choose plane table appears so you can select your next plane. As the game progresses, the choose plane table will only show the numbers of planes you have not sol or have not yet solved. Solving each plane increases the difficulty of the unsolved planes. So I guess, uh, okay, all right. So the planes don't just get more difficult because the higher number, it's just which order you've played them in. The game gets harder no matter what order you play it in. Yeah. So, game controls. Use these controls to roll the eight ball. Uh, joystick, there's no keys. Uh, letter keys. Okay, so you can either do the arrow keys, joysticks, or if you're using the letter keys, I moves you up, M moves you down, J and I moves you uh, uh, northwest, J moves you west, J and M moves you uh, southwest, M moves you south, and so on. So you get one, six, so you have eight directions available on the uh, keys, letter keys. Press the fire button. To or space to bar to jump. Press P to pause the game. Press it again to continue. Press Q to guess what? Begin a new game and choose the plane table. Surviving the planes. Oh, I'm stuffed up. 
Time is your worst enemy. The upper right corner of the screen shows the time units you have left to complete the plane. As you roll through the planes, keep an eye out for the symbols below. Some are beneficial, some are bothersome, and some are downright lethal. Touch the goal to complete each plane. You end the game and return to, shoot to the choose plane table if you bump into a eliminator or time runs out. It's up to you. Uh, okay, plane one. Roll or bounce the length of the plank and drop through the void into the five subplanes. Two hints. In subplane three, avoid the electric C. It speeds up the clock. And I'm trying to figure out this other word, slalom. To the finish in subplane five. If you leave plane one before solving all the five subplanes, you can return to it later to complete them. Plane two, roll over keys in the, in the right order to open the doors. Roll near, roll near keys to make more keys appear. Use teleports to scout out the entire maze. <sighs> plane three. Stay out of the electric sea. Could be shocking. Find four hidden amulets to make the goal appear. Plane four. Race down the track as fast as you can using diagonal controls or left and right moves. Avoid time draining blocks and use lifts up and down since your bump since your jumps are limited. Uh, plane five, fill the puzzle with tiled squares. Plane six, grab the right four surprises to see the goal. Some surprises give you jumps. If you grab the wrong surprises, you turn on a pneumatic tube. This is plural and wind up at, uh, and wind up at an eliminator. Oh, so it's like shoot, doo, 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 pump, pop. Uh. All right, plane seven. Pick up extra boosters. You can use them in other planes. Pick up all the time boosters to play extra level. Plane eight. Roll over all four keys in one of the four mazes before you run out of time. Plane 9. Bash out all the cubes. Energizers temporarily boost your speed. Avoid the flashing squirrels. Oh, squares. I hate flashing squirrels. No. Let's see. As long as we don't have to deal with violent balls. Right. Plane 10. Bounce from platform to platform, but tackle only one... Oh, one unit of height at a time to avoid a time penalty. Get to the goal as fast as you can. The bonus plane. Follow the arrows to play. When the round ends, press space bar or the fire button to get back to the choose plane table. Ah, scoring. You score points by rolling over these symbols. An amulet gives you five points. A key gives you two points. Surprise is two points. When you successfully complete a plane, any time units remaining are converted into points. For example, five time units remaining earn you five points. Time left when you finish a plane also carries over to the next plane you play. Bonus rounds are worth 20 points. All right, Mind Roll Color Computer Conversion was programmed by Jesse Taylor and tested by Eric Flom and Scott Duckett, who apparently missed, missed Plane 1. 
Uh, Epic and Mind Roll are trademarks of somebody or another, and and so on. The original Mind Roll game program is copyright '88 by Tenemus Limited. All right, the back cover. Roll off the edge of infinity into dimensions that have no room for mental midgets. Dodge electrical seas, bounce the lights out of the flashing checkerboard squares, and blow up blocks that keep you bouncing to the next thrilling plane. Ten incredible dimensions to conquer. Yeah. Okay. Whew. That was the directions. That must have been a nice thick book. Yeah, that was a novel. Yeah. Our guest said hi, Sloopy. Our guest said hi, Yeah, Sloopy. I didn't want to interrupt the tyrannic read mm. the instructions. Excuse me. You know, it's kind of tonight's show kind of kind of reflects the kind of the rest of the world my work has been pretty dead slow all week traffic's been fairly light and there ain't too many of us here everybody must be a spring break could be So, uh, Frank, why don't you join us and play? Three different people running the same thing, and all three, the screen looks different. Well, I'm on VCC. What are y'all doing? I'm on VCC. What are y'all doing? Ken's on VCC also. Ken's on VCC also. I'm on actually. Hmm. And ran, I wandered away. Yeah, I think so. No, I've been talking to you guys for like the last two minutes with my um, microphone on mute. Oh, okay. Is that Peach Good problem job. too? Hmm. Hey, nobody said I was too smart. <laughs> I'm just pretty, not smart. No, just plain old pretty. No, just plain old pretty. says he can't hear you, Sloopy. says he can't hear you, Stop bragging. <laughs> oh, well, we, we purposely have Kurt Sloopy turned right down so that we can't hear him echo. Just for you, Curtis. Mm. <laughs> yep. So really, actually, Sloopy is kind of like the the voice in all of our heads that nobody else can hear. Oh, hang on. Nope. Oh. All right, and just a second. Now, now speak. You're very, very faint, but that's fine. How's that? 
I have to turn my volume on so I can hear you. Volume on. But you have your volume off so you don't. No, no, just on Twitch, so that I don't have to listen to the um, re- so I don't have to listen to the repeat and mess myself up by all of a sudden hearing myself talking like three seconds after I start talking. All right, time to play. All right, time to play. Um, Curtis, as opposed to what bird? Oh, it's Coco 3 version. That's what, why I'm playing. Coco 3. Oh. Why I'm playing. Both are probably playing the Coco 3 version. You're playing the Coco 1. You just have to be different. You just have to be different. Okay, so yes, we can hear Sloopy now. I'm sorry. We're sorry. I know. Not really. Just remember, everybody out there, it was Curtis that asked for it. Yes. <laughs> now you should be able to hear me really well. Curtis, this is just for you. This bud's for you. <coughs> Can you hear me now? Unfortunately. Unfortunately. I should have been really loud at that point. Should have been really loud at that point. So on Twitch, there's a loop back. So on Twitch, there's a loop back. That's because mm. Sloopy turned his sound way up. Sloopy turned his sound way up. No, actually, I put the microphone closer to my mouth. Yeah, Sloopy doesn't do headphones because they mess up his hair. Sloopy doesn't do headphones because they mess up his hair. Ah, there we go. They do what? Headphones mess up your hair. Headphones mess up your hair. Hmm. What kind of uh, no? Hey, that was my high score. 
on my what thirty five hundred on my very last game. Yeah. Huh. I'd gotten thirty six. I guess we're before that. But... I guess we're tied. Oh. So I got to get better than thirty six hundred. You're saying. What's your high score on it? Um. Just let me check. Uh, photos. Did I beat? Th- Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, 49,700. Oh, geez. Crackers. Well, I guess you get the win on that one. <laughs> oh, by the way, I'm joking. <laughs> I know I got higher than that last week on it, but I don't know. I didn't post a score of it. So far, 6,500 is my high score. Oh, that's even worse. Go back to worse. joking. Go back to joking? Yeah. Okay. 49,000 then. No, I said 49,700. Oh. Jeez. Yeah, 3,600 is the highest I posted. I think I got higher than that last week, but I didn't... Uh, Posted because I figured I'd play this week and get something higher, and I haven't been doing that well. You could always look back in the footage. Yeah, but that sounds like too much work. Yeah, I'm definitely not doing as well this week as I did last week. Jeez, where is everybody this week? Has Mark fallen asleep already? Well, not really, but almost there. You'd think with the time change, you'd have less sleep. <laughs> yeah, he's an hour short of sleep until the fall. Yeah. Only to level three on one uh, life. I'm only on level two. Level two. I've, 
I've still never made level three. Ooh, new high score though. Let's see. Ah, darn it. Don't do that. Dead, damn it. You should have got a one hundred more points. I should have. I should have gotten a hundred points for running into that guy. And then nine more points for avoiding the sharks. Oh well. Oh hey, I'm highlighted. I guess I should play again. Yeah. I was busy trying to figure out how to use my phone. Use your phone. I had to take a picture. Oh. I had to take a picture. Screen capture wouldn't work. I could have done that, but I could have done that, but that sounds like so much work. Yeah, there's a bunch of key presses together that will allow you to do a uh, screenshot. I know. Don't know what they are. My problem is I can never remember what they are. Yeah, I just usually have uh, what's it called? Uh, I usually have snipping tool running. That's what I use when I remember to, but that's what I use when I remember to, but <coughs> are you using digital joystick or keyboard? Digital joystick, why? Wonder. I'm using an Xbox controller. Uh. This game is very difficult using a deluxe. It's very difficult anyway. Yeah. I, think I mean, you... considering that they, I always, I always um, kind of have to laugh at how authors have uh, um, given you so much room for making their score. So, Mm -hmm. You can technically get up to 999,999 before you're going to wrap the score on this. Yep. Not a problem. Boy, that the author of this had uh, high expectations for people's abilities. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, I think he might, he expected people to get like 100,000. That's pretty high expectations for people's abilities. Yeah, well, uh, pre pre Buck Owens and Tasman uh, AIs were around back then, so he was taking that into account.
I think my biggest issue with the game is that each shot takes a lot of air out of you. Well, if you blew enough air out of your lungs to blow a uh, bird away, then I think it would take a lot of air out of you. You can do it. Ah. Oh. No, I think sixty seven is going to be my highest sixty seven hundred. Okay, you can take the spotlight off me. I can. I think, let's see, who, who deserves the spotlight now? Does anybody play? <laughs> it's an Annie. Falling apart. Welcome. Uh oh, oh everybody, us. cover your children's ears. Annie's here. <laughs> and if you're sneaking this oh, behind your parents back get your paper and pencil to learn a lot of words <laughs> hey I thought that <laughs> hey it's how I learned the words what games are we playing mind We're roll and dawn pan again we're playing Mind roll and, and and the other game I don't like. Yep. We kept it. We're we're thinking of even an, a third week on this one just for you. <laughs> Did you guys just start? No. Did you guys just start? We started an hour oh. ago. Oh yeah, so we're just late. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Sorry, we we're cooking dinner. Ooh, what's for dinner? Food. Food. Hopefully. Poutine. No poutine. No poutine. I don't know how to get it on speaker. Uh, Ken, you're not supposed to shoot the balloons with air. Oh, shut up. <laughs> and try not to eat, get eaten by fish. Try not to eat, get eaten by fish. Well, there you go. See what happens when you distract me? I get eaten by fish. <laughs> I think you're supposed to eat the fish. How is that fair? No one said life was fair. That's it. I quit. And you were so close to beating your uh, high score. Again. Again. Barnacle sharks are the most dangerous kind. Barnacle sharks are the most dangerous kind. Well, I hope they choke on my balloon. <laughs> He's making burp one good time. He's making burp one good time. I hope when they burp, the balloon inflates and they float away. Oh, flying vertical sharks. Oh, flying vertical sharks. Is that going to be the new Sharknado movie? <laughs> Maybe. Sharks and balloons. Don't give him any ideas. Don't make another movie.
Oh my. Hello, hello. Well, it's about time you joined us. I completely forgot. I finished at 7 o'clock and started at 7 at work today, so. <laughs> What's on the menu today? Uh, cursing, swearing, and... Uh insulting of uh, various bread products. Mmm. Nutroid part of it? Nope. Hey, I'm always up for insulting Nutroid. Yeah, because I mean, that, that, I mean, that's not cussing and swearing. That's Julian Delight. Okay, so what bread products are we mad at besides my pita? Um, it depends on um, how mad you are. I mean, my pita broke while I was eating it, so now my food's everywhere. Oh, I was thinking of a different pita. No, that one's sitting in the chair over there. Ah. <laughs> uh -huh. It's a pita or a platter. Good Lord, whose uh, slogan was that? For their salads or something. I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, He's gonna hook us up in a minute here. Do you do you hear this um tune a lot in your head, Sloopy? It used to be a commercial. I think it was uh uh huh, yes, sure it is. Uh, uh, it's I'm a sure Peter? It's like oh, no. they offered salads or something. You could get it in a pita or on a platter. It sounds like the pita pit here. No, it was one of the national chains of uh, fast food restaurants. Well, I'm Canadian, so our national chains are different. Yay, another Canadian. Yeah. We're taking over. We're taking over. What part? Southwestern Ontario. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Burger King, uh, 1983. Burger King salad bar. Pita pita Ew. or a platter. Ew. Oh, that's just gross. Well, that's just gross. Whopper wings. Wait, nobody in this world want Whopper. Nobody in this world want Whopper. Do what? My husband likes Whopper Wednesday, and I can't stand Burger King. Oh, I like Burger King. Good for you. I went to uh, McDonald's the other morning for breakfast. That will be the last time I ever go to McDonald's for breakfast. Why? So you went to McToken Pukes and didn't expect a McToken Pukes? Um, <laughs> because it's a, it's a very, very expensive restaurant now. It's a high-class restaurant. It yeah. is. I got three uh, breakfast sandwiches and two uh, hash browns, and it was almost $30. Yeah. Uh, and that was USD, right? Yes. Yeah, so it was about $45. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, I mean, that's how all fast food restaurants are going now. Gee, I, went, I only did eight bucks yesterday at McDonald's. What did you get, a coffee? Ah, oh, big breakfast with uh, uh, the English muffin. Yeah, I went to uh, Wawa, and uh, I got two uh, breakfast sandwiches and um, two drinks for free. Oh, no, wait. That's because my daughter bought it. I got two breakfast sandwiches, two hash browns, and two drinks, and it was like 16 bucks. Yeah, well, I always go to McDonald's with somebody else, and then it's free. Yeah. Well, well around here, Burger King, you get two breakfast sandwiches for five bucks. Yeah. Yeah, I used to like their McGriddles at McDonald's. Mine's and mine's too. 
Is it mind roll or mind roll two? Mind roll. There's a second one? Mind roll. Is it mind roll two? Apparently. On my SD card. Well, one of them might be for the Coco 3. Oh, there's a Coco and a Coco, a Coco 1 and 2 version and a Coco 3 version. Which one is which? Oh. Uh, the one that looks prettier on the Coco 3 is the Coco 3 version. Yeah. The one that won't run on the Coco 1 and 2 is the Coco 3 version. <laughs> <laughs> My thoughts exactly? Sounds logical. You still gotta hook up. And where is your computer? Are you? Okay. I could load mine. No. Okay. I told her earlier that I was streaming. Okay. Well, that one doesn't work. <laughs> Which one was that? My roll two didn't work. Okay, so it must have been the Coco three version. Well, this is a Coco. Oh, well, I'm confused then. I have no idea what mind roll two is. Now I want to check on my SD card and see. Worm Food says, I, joke to... I jokingly asked my British friend if he ever had English muffins. And he commented that the ones from McDonald's are better than the traditional ones they make in England. Oof. Okay, neither of them work. And... Oh, 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 there we go. There what the hell does that say? I don't know where are my glasses. Are. I don't know where are my glasses. Oh my god, Jason. I guess you guys would be happy to know that somehow this cocoa is becoming a permanent fixture in our living room. Yay! It's addictive. I'm not sure how this happened. That's exactly where it should be. Uh, stop bragging. No, I'm just not sure how it happened. No, I'm just not sure how it could be worse. Well, it may have been the trade off to get a second aquarium if I had to put up with having the cocoa in here. So uh, there's no need for an aquarium. Well, it's better. It's better than being uh, getting pregnant and saying I don't know how that happened. <laughs> if I was, I'd have to say that. I don't know how that would happen. <laughs> yeah, when, uh, when my ex making got, fun of you. When my ex got pregnant with uh, my uh, first, well, my second son, my mother said, how'd that happen? And I'm like, I'm the child. You're the parent. You're supposed to explain this to me. <laughs> you know, the birds and the bees. Okay, I'm just going to have to get out of All right, we're out here, boys. Okay. All right, let's see here. Oh, this person did. And uh, Frederick, are you going to share a game screen or no? We must buy a capture card at some point. Yeah. <laughs> you must play a what? We need a capture card at some point so we can not have to move two million pieces of furniture around just to share the screen. Um, I use a nice one that's only 10 bucks. Okay. Works well on most games. Uh, 
Oh, we one of us has to go on mute. Let me hit chair or something. Here. Oh, you can mute. You can, I'm gonna go I can mute. mute this one. That's fine. I'll mute this. Is that one? Okay. If I go this exit, that. Oh. Okay. Is it over? All right. Okay. Yay. So now you guys can mute. Yeah. Ben, why does your uh, screen just randomly blinking off for one tenth of a second? So I have to constantly hit the uh, watch button again. Just to mess with you. I can't hear them on yours. Uh, it's okay here. So you can sit too. Um, you need to turn those fellas up. Yeah. Oh, I turned them down. I don't understand. Okay. Uh, it wants. Oh, can you pick up the joystick? Oh, nice. You can pick up the joystick. No, but the joystick is seeming weird. Weird. Yeah. Oh shit! Why am I going so? Shoot! I mean. this game not have any sound? Or what's it muted? You muted the TV. So what are we playing? Fine. Games? Uh, we're playing uh, cussing and swearing. I don't know. All right, let me try to find that one. Cussing. Nope, not there. Swearing. It's right beside Neutroid. Canadian. Yeah. Um, we're playing... Uh, Don Pan again, and we're playing Mind Roll. Mind Roll is Mind Dash Roll. Okay, this is boring. <laughs> I think you got hold of the cartridge version there, low level. That's the one with the bug. Oh, well, there's, there's something wrong with this one? Yeah, don't play the cartridge version, by the way. Well, <laughs> I don't know which one? Yeah, you want to go into Which cartridge games of mind roll? Yeah, I'm like, ooh, what a fun game! Go how do, how do you know if it's the cartridge version? Because you go uh, number one and it game. just goes one long. It was the disc version. Um, this this is a disc emulator, is it not? Yeah, yeah, but it so can it also play be... carts. Can it? I don't think so. It, it looked like a disk version. Watch. It loads a message um, file, but still. It was originally a cartridge. Mind roll disk should be fine, right? Well, that's what I loaded. So this is the one. Mind roll 2 here didn't load. And then mind roll loaded. Um, maybe that is a cartridge rip and it, the basic just loads the stuff into RAM and kicks it off. That's what mine shows. I've got. Yeah. So that's the one to run, mind roll basic. Yeah, mind roll basic. Oh, that's, that's what we were just playing. Just don't play level one. Well, oh. were you in that long, endless hallway on level one? Yeah. What's wrong with level one? Because I'm playing off the SD card and... Uh... So play level two. Well... You can choose any you gotta, one of them. Did you, did you just roll off? You got to roll off the end of the hallway if you're... Because it shouldn't be the uh, broken version if you've got the SD card. Yeah, it's off the SD card, so I don't know why we... Well, bring up level one again. I want to see what... How do you restart? How do I get out of this without... Ah, uh, you just got to die. How do you die? Wait. Wait 72... No, I'm not waiting 70 seconds. Ah! Yeah.
Okay, so games. Um, annoying roll. Oh, got the volume. What am I supposed to do? Level level one? So you want us to go to level one? Yeah, I want to see because I'm playing the. Uh, I should be playing the same version as you. And yeah, we get this. Okay, so then move forward. Oh, you do have the broken version. Huh. I don't understand. Yeah, it's a you. You've got a broken version, which I've never seen in the disc version before. So. So what do I do? Just keep going straight till it goes to level two? Well, no, you can't you can't beat level one into that one. You you just read the down you should re-download it from the archive and stick it on your SD card. Oh god, that's too hard. Oh I didn't you could jump. You can jump, but but it doesn't do anything. You should go forward about four squares and then go off the end and that should be the end of the le- of, the, of that oh. part of the level. This this was actually the version that was released. This past the uh, so you've got to play everything but level one then. Okay, so play level two. Why? Why what? Why everything but level one? For them because they they don't want to download the uh, fixed version. They've got the broken version. Uh. Huh? It's only worth about 50 points anyway. It's only worth about 50 points anyway. I don't understand this. I just got 54 this. points. This joystick is not fun to use. Oh, you got a key. Oh, this is like weird. I don't know where I'm going or what I'm doing. I think the keys are points. Uh, I don't know. Every level wanted is a different puzzle that you have to solve. Huh? You have to solve the puzzle, apparently. I'm not good with puzzles. No. So on level two there, that's basically just picking up keys to open doors so that you can get to the end. And those things, if you run right over the middle of them, they transport you to a different spot in the maze. This is eye bending. I really want to know who developed these games. <laughs> this is not very good. Oh, look, I died. Jesse Taylor. <laughs> Your turn. What is with this joystick? I don't know. It's not working. Yeah. Oh, and so I was working with a joystick that wasn't where else. Dude, do you want me to move over so no, you can no. get closer? Yeah, that's fine. That's pretty screwy. Yeah, it's screwy. We could mess with it for that other game. Yeah. Now, so. Come on, get in there. Come on. I venture to guess skull and crossbones are bad. Oh, you have a time limit. Yeah. I don't believe in time limits. Yeah, I don't understand what I'm supposed to do here either. 
and what you're speaking to here. Let's look for team one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This bag's too small for me to get my name into. <laughs> too much noise. When it can't play retro video games without Reese's Pieces. Really? That's how it works? That's why I did so bad at this. Made a bold, but they did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Somebody left the chat. I still don't understand the point in jumping because not like um, you can jump over. I there. assume on other levels there might be there might be, yeah. There might be enemies that you jump over on other levels. Why won't it work? There we go. And it looks like they limit jumps in some levels. You're going to get a bowl now? Well, I might as well make a little more thing. I'm going to use some of the template. Oh. Oh, come on. I've got a little joystick that's causing me to do things I don't want to do. Okay, well, I can't get that. Try again. What is wrong with this joystick? I'm still not entirely sure what I'm supposed to do besides picking up keys. Are those the doors? I don't know. No, they don't appear to be. Well, this is definitely sucky. So far, highest score is like four. So far, no. eight, 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 eight. Eight. You at eight? Yeah. All right, I'm back. What did I miss? Everything. You missed the great, great shot that Sloopy did. What was it? What was he shooting? Oh, right, wrong game. Ducks. 
I was playing Duck Hunt. Can I request better games to be chosen? <laughs> nope. <laughs> no. Actually, really busy. Yeah. Yes, you could actually request better games. Yes, you could actually so request. request? Games. So request. Dude, I would rather play Tetris than this. We've already played Tetris. Play it again. <laughs> we played many mm -hmm. versions of Tetris already. Well, how about that? One more, you have to catch the beer. Tapper. Tapper. Yep, we played Play that. Tapper. We played that. Only it wasn't called Tapper, right? It's got a different name. I still think for uh, for a ton of giggles, we should play BC Bill. Because I still think that game is freaking hilarious. Sure, but you're doing the uh, instructions reading. <laughs> it's in uh, Mark's contract that uh, he uh, doesn't have to. I'm a woman on with this message. <laughs> I had to explain to it. It was a different time, right? It was, yeah. but I played to a 20 something year old the game BC Bill the other day. Mm -hmm. He's like, No, there's no game like that. So I sent him the YouTube video. It's like, What? <laughs> I'm like, Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, Yeah. Oh, that's how you open the door. You got, when you got that key, it went through a door. I did? Yes. How do you know? I know my brain hurts from looking at it. <laughs> So I hit 10 points there. Okay. Come on. Like, is that a door right there? Yeah. It is a door. It is a door, but oh. you have to have the key to unlock it, apparently. Oh, I'm learning dumb things. I mean, new things. So if you get that, I would go on. My brain is hurting from looking at this. I hear you. Okay. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I opened the door. Yeah, you did it turn. Okay, now that we figured that crap out. Okay, now that we figured that Oh, what's that? I don't know. Oh, it looks like a skull. Maybe that's the end of the level. If I Maybe you die if you hit it. I don't know. Why can't <laughs> get over here? I don't know. Why can't get over here? Back here again. Mm, yeah, I'm going to go to bed too. Sorry if I wasn't here that uh, that long. It's Shame up. on you. Yeah. We'll let, let it slide this time. <laughs> I'm not sure we will. <laughs> All right, good night. Good night, good night Frederick. Good night. Good night, Frederick. I'm confused. Where did I go? Oh, I'm going to die in two seconds. No, no, duh. And it's done. But who's left in here anyway? Nobody. Just us. Nobody. 
Just us slackers. My daughter's asking me what time will I be. She's told her boss over and over again she can't be there at 10 o'clock on Thursday. And he still schedules her for 10 o'clock on Thursday. So she's like, well, if I'm late on every Thursday, maybe he'll get the hint. So she just messaged me and said, where are you at? And I says, I'll be there in 10 minutes. Uh, no, I'll leave, I'll leave in 10 minutes. And she Oh, that's right. Today's Thursday. Oh. Oh, you do die. You do die if you touch it. <laughs> All right. I'll play again. So, Ken, what are you playing? I am playing Monster Maze. I am playing Monster Maze. Is this a foreshadowing of uh, hell to come? Eventually, probably. They can shoot through walls. They can shoot through walls. Can you? Shoot if they move walls? right up to the walls, they, can... they can... no. Well, I'm actually I don't know if you can or not. Okay, so you need keys. I don't know if you can get close enough to a wall to shoot through a wall. <laughs> not like that. Oops. Not like that. Huh. I can shoot through a wall if I go right up to it. Oof. I died. He decapitated you. Like a Coco 5000 game. I mean, it did only take me like 200 hours to finish Baldur's Gate 3, but you know. What? Uh, Curtis says, yes, you can, but only up, left, right. Yeah, because you, you can't get your gun close enough down. So now, I wonder if that was actually intended or was it a mistake go either way uh retro techie i didn't deny you your mother denied denied me so so blame her Oof. i think this loops Uh, I have no idea. Yeah, it leaps. <clears throat> this was one of the very first games I had, one of the original games I had for my Coco. Way, way back in the day. The cartridge or cassette? I had it on cartridge. Ooh, that went through my arm. Yeah. I went through your body. Basically, it seems like a uh, combination of a dungeon crawler and Zerk. Yep. Flip the switches on this the is board. just like that Rick Adams game, Temple of Rom, that, where you're the guy in space going through the uh, space pyramid. Hmm. <laughs> You deaded. Ah, uh, deaded. You know dying is not conducive to a high score. Uh, you know, 
I have a feeling I have no way to get through here. <laughs> okay, yeah, that sucks. I'm, I i don't know, I'm going to lose 34 seconds left and I only have like four keys. Oh, well. <coughs> I forgot all about that game. I forgot all about that game. Which, mine roll? No, Monster Maze. Is it better than mine? So at this point, I feel anything's better than this. Mine is that game from last week that really, really. Which the all of the one with the Don Pan? Such negativity. <laughs> no. Oh my god. She's harsh in my vibe, man. She's harsh in my vibe. She's harsh in my vibe, man. Who, me? Yeah. All the negativity. We're used to better games, that's all. I'm used to better games. Wait. Oh, uh, what are you, an Atari person? <laughs> yes. Are you a what? Atari person. No. All right. Well, I'm going to end the stream here. All right. Okay. So. Then I can go have supper. Yeah. yeah. Good night, everyone. Thank you for tuning in to another great episode of the Coco Nation Game on Challenge Live, where this week we played Mind Roll and Don Pan. And, well, we had other words for them, but those those words will suffice. Join us Saturday when we will be listing the uh, high scores for Don Pan. We will also be giving tips and tricks. And a uh, cheat sheet of... Uh, First words that uh, go that pair well with it. Also, the only way to win is to not play the game. <laughs> that is absolutely correct. <laughs> also, we will be uh, announcing the new game for uh, the fo for the following two weeks, which will be Ken. I guess you'll have to tune in to find out. <laughs>